and we're live. <laughs> All right, guys, today I'm going to show you a really quick way to make a no-bake, easy, really, really easy protein recipe. Okay, this is going to be like a brownie. It's going to come really, really good. I eat this almost every night, so it's really simple, easy to do. So, all we need is, you need protein. You can do vanilla or chocolate. Sometimes I mix them, I'll do one scoop of each. Um, we're going to throw some chocolate chips on this one today. Okay, and baking powder. All right, so really simple. So I got my bowl here. You kind of need a big bowl because this is going to fluff up. All right, we got our food scale. So let's get all the ingredients in here. And I sprayed this with Pam, so that's what's inside there. I just might have put a little bit too much. So I'm going to do this with two scoops of protein powder. So I'm just going to measure out two scoops of protein powder just to make sure it's right on the money. I'm like getting half scoops. but So it's 68 grams. And there you go. All right, now you need... We'll zero this out like three to five grams of baking soap, baking powder. That's kind of sometimes I always over pour it, so I got one. Let's see, perfect. So, four. All right, so now what we're gonna do, you just want to kind of mix these dry ingredients together, and you could kind of customize this and make it however you want. So, we're gonna add a little bit of water to this. All right, very little because we want it put in consistency. So get the water on here. And you don't want it running like that because if I put it underneath there like that, it'll make soup. And then you'd be drinking from the bowl. So we want it like dripping. This force is a little tough to do it, but all right, there we go. So just a little bit. I always add a little bit of water, a little at a time. Because again, like I said, if you put too much water, you have soup. And we're not looking for soup, we're looking for like a pudding consistency. Mixing, see it's getting there. So it should start, it's gonna to start to clump up like that, but that's exactly what we want. A little bit more water. So think of like pudding, that's kind of exactly what we want. So it's still a little thick. That's about the consistency we want. So you see, that's exactly what we want here. That's the kind of consistency that we need. All right, let's just give it another little mix up here. So again, I got the baking soda in here. I got the protein powder in here. All right, and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put in the microwave. All right, now the trick is if you cook this too much, it's gonna make a hockey puck. So we don't want that. So we're gonna put in the microwave, okay? We're gonna, usually I get away with doing it in about 45 seconds, but because we're gonna put the chocolate chips on there, we're gonna put it on for 20 seconds. Whoop. Two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> you can't win. So I just gotta watch this thing. You can't win. All right, we're at 10 seconds. 15. Well, now we're 15. And we are at 20 seconds. So pull it out. So actually this, this micro is a little weak, but you can see it's starting to clump up a little bit. So I like to, what I usually do here is, I'll add the chocolate chips after. Now I already pre-measured this out, so I'm putting two servings of these on here. So in one serving is 14 grams. And these aren't too bad, four grams of fat, nine carbs, but it just adds a lot of flavor. All right, so we're gonna put 28 grams in here. See, like 28 grams is going to be a lot. As you can see, they're already starting to sink. I, I went over because I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> so, guys, this is live. So you see how it's start, they're starting to sink? So we want them to kind of stay there. So I got to put it back in the microwave really quick. And I'll put it in for 30 seconds. Hey, go. Go. Start. You have to hit the start button. <laughs> Where's the start button? There you go. <laughs> there you go. There we go. 30 seconds. So now we just wait. So... I went over a little bit on the chocolate chips, but it's okay. So I'm excited to see what it's gonna look like. I'm actually gonna stop this a little bit beforehand just to make sure. So we're at 15 seconds, and I'll just stop it and we'll look. So it's getting there. You can see it's starting to fluff up over here. 
a lot of this the chocolate chips sank already, but there'll be more at the bottom. We'll put it in. Start. Let's give it that another 15 seconds. It might need a little bit more. This microwave is a little bit weaker than the other microwave that we have, but this is the filming room here. All right. All right. So let's go <laughs> five seconds. <laughs> And let's take a look. <laughs> All right, so here you go. So it fluffed up. So if you could see, so it's like this is a little soft. It could actually go a couple more seconds, but you can see here it's still a little gooey, still soft, but the middle is nice and runny, so I love it like that. So it kind of makes like a little cake. So as you can see, the chocolate chips are melting. See that? Nice. So it's full of protein. This is two scoops of protein, okay? Again, really simple. Give it a taste test. Perfect. But look, so you guys can see. So now in the middle here, the bowl's a little hot, but it's, it's you know thick like a brownie. Okay, but I like it a little soft like this because I kind of mix it in. So not bad. So again, guys, don't be afraid. Use protein powder in other ways because when you're dieting and you want a good snack like that, this is perfect. And again, adding something like this in there, very little amount of calories in there, and it adds a lot of flavor. You can put some Cool Whip on top of this, but go ahead, experiment with this, get crazy, use all different flavors of protein powder and different combinations, and you'll be surprised at what you can come up with. See you guys on the next one.